Hello everyone, this is Nate with Photodex, and today I'm going to show you how to easily replace layers in your slides. I'm using ProShow Producer, but everything you'll see in this tutorial works the same way in ProShow Gold. Let's start by taking a look at this slide. I like the effect, but as I scrub through the preview, this last picture just doesn't quite fit with the other two. Rather than recreate the entire effect, I'm simply going to change what's in that layer. In this example, I'm going to choose another photo, but if I wanted to, I could also select a video clip and the steps would stay the same. Let's double click on the slide to open the slide options. Now, I'm going to move the slide options window over just a little so that I can see the folder and file list. This will allow me to browse through my photos and videos until I find the right replacement image. Once I find the replacement, I'm going to click and drag the photo from the file list into the layers list. To replace the image, I'm going to hover over the image that I want to change. See how it becomes highlighted? Now, I'm going to let go of the mouse button and that will drop the new photo into place. Let's go ahead and hit OK to apply the changes and close the slide options window. As I preview the slide again, you can see that the motion, timing, and photo border are exactly the same as before, but now my slide features the new image. This really comes in handy when you have a show that's already done and you just want to swap out an image or two. This method also comes in handy when creating new slides using slide styles that feature more than one image. Let's create a new slide using one image and then open the slide options for the new slide. Click the slide styles tab to see all of the style options. I'm going to choose a built-in style from the basic montages category called alternating portrait tilt dark. Once I apply the style, over in the slide list you'll notice that ProShow has added four more layers to my slide. Let's close the slide options window for a bit just to preview what the effect looks like. The gray placeholders are where I need to add photos or videos to complete the slide. So to do this, let's go back to the slide options and add some content. Just like before, I'm going to move the slide options window over just a bit and then drag and drop some images into those layers. After dropping the images onto the desired layers, let's click OK to apply the changes and close the slide options window. As I scrub through the preview, you can see the finished effect. By simply dragging and dropping, we've filled placeholders and replaced the content of our layers. And that's all for today's lesson. Thank you all for watching and be sure to check out our other training videos on our YouTube channel or visit our blog for helpful tips and tricks about creating slideshows with ProShow.